Hello everyone and welcome to another Houdini quick tip. You have multiple functions and tools to measure the distance between points to measure the size of an object. In Houdini you have the geometry spreadsheet where you can find all the data related to your object in your scene. But what if you want to have a quick and fast representation in the viewport how big your object is or how far different points are from each other. So for that, you can use the labs ruler tool. So go into this note field and press the tab key and type in ruler and click on the ruler. And you can see this box shows up down here. So this box says click and drag on the geometry to measure it. Press the Q key to copy the last measurement to clipboard, press the F key to copy to clip and remove the last measurement. So let's do that. Click and drag, and you can see that it's creating this ruler lines with measurement data in the viewport. And you also can see that I can navigate on my viewport and these ruler lines stays in place. This is quite handy and visual pleasing. So if I want to know now how big my cube is, I can click on a corner and drag it down and release. And it gives me approximate value. So I can assume, okay, so this cube is about one meter, but it's not exactly the number that I'm looking for. Okay, to be more accurate, let's press the F key and delete all these measurements that we did right there. So if I want to be more accurate, I can turn on the point snapping tool, which is this icon here on the sidebar, this point snapping tool. And when I now go in here, you can see that it snaps to the point. I can click and drag until it snaps. And it shows me exactly one meter. I can create another measurement, one meter here, one meter here, and so on. So now let's say I want to know how far this point is from that point here. So I can click and drag, and it gives me exactly this value. Okay, so I know this point is 0 0.83 and so on centimeters away from that point here. So you can also show the point number and you can see that this point number two is 0 0.83 centimeters away from the point 98 from the sphere. So you have an easy and visual pleasing representation of data. So now what if you want to store this value Okay, so it says here, press the Q key, and then it says copy. It's copy only the last measurement. So in this case, this 0 0.83 value. And then you can say, I want to scale down this cube based on this distance. I can control paste this value into the uniform scale. And you can see that now this cube has scaled down based on this distance. You also can store these values on a editor, right? You can see that this measurement is stored also here in this editor window for later use when you want to create a VEX code or something like that, you have the values in here. But as I said, you can find those values as well into the gem tree spreadsheet but you can see with only these two objects in the scene i have a lot of values in the geometry spreadsheet sometimes if i want to have just a quick representation on how far a point is from another point i can use the ruler and i have a very nice and pleasing visual representation of the measurement so that's it that's the labs ruler tool inside houdini I hope you liked this quick tip 
If you have any questions or requests for other quick tips, please let me know in the comments. If you like my content, please like, comment and subscribe and get the notification when a new tutorial coming up. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. See you next time and bye everybody.